Yeah, I think recognizing it is just the main, the main thing. Recognizing it and just trying to do something is your first stepping stone, I think. I think it started fairly early on, um, maybe when my little one was maybe newly born. Part of it was the sadness, but there was another part of it that wasn't just sadness, it was anxiety. I would have what I now know were panic attacks, so I'd be in a fairly normal situation and then this overwhelming feeling would come over me of like you're failing and you're in this hole but people are watching you but not doing anything about it. Um, it was just quite an intense feeling of not being able to cope um, with things that should be normal like washing up and washing clothes and housework. A lot of lack of sleep <laughs> doesn't help with that. Things got worse and worse and I didn't get diagnosed until he was eight months old and so I think because it had time to set in it got quite bad. Nobody else did notice. It was myself who went to the doctor to ask for extra help just because I felt so alone. Once I spoke to one, someone who understood, um, initially he tried me on some homeopathic medicine called sepia, um, which helped to a small extent, but I think I was beyond that. Um, and so then I went on some, some antidepressant drugs. And after trying a few, I then found one that helped a little bit. But I think actually the main thing that has helped me recover is more the things I could do for myself rather than just medication. Knowing there are other people out there who are going through what you're going through, it might be a different variation of things, but that they can relate to you. So joining a group such as Bluebell and doing their course has been really, really good. Music, if you put in-ear headphones in, things with an uplifting beat. It can do something, it can just, yeah, it's good. Oh, also finding your flow with something. So one thing that I used to do was crochet. If you're working with color and, and texture and you're making something, it just distracts you so much that you can achieve something and also just forget things for a bit. I think now I've got quite a lot of tools to help manage how I feel um, so that I'm more in control of, of feeling happy. <laughs>